Look Back in Anger is a landmark play by John Osborne, first performed in 1956. The play is set in a one-room flat in the Midlands of England and revolves around the lives of Jimmy Porter, his wife Allison, and their friend Cliff Lewis. The play explores themes of class struggle, disillusionment, and the complexities of personal relationships in post-war Britain. It is a quintessential example of the angry young men movement in British literature. The play opens in the cramped, cluttered apartment shared by Jimmy, Allison, and Cliff. The setting is a metaphor for the emotional and social confinement experienced by the characters. Jimmy, a university graduate working at a sweet stall, feels trapped and frustrated by his circumstances. His anger and disillusionment with society are palpable from the beginning, setting the tone for the entire play. Jimmy Porter is the central character, known for his biting wit and relentless criticism of the world around him. He directs much of his anger towards his wife, Allison, and the middle-class values she represents. Jimmy's tirades reveal his deep-seated frustrations with the British class system and the lack of opportunities for those, like him, who feel marginalized. His anger also stems from a sense of betrayal by the establishment and a yearning for a more meaningful existence. Alison Porter, Jimmy's wife, is portrayed as a passive and long-suffering character. She endures Jimmy's verbal abuse and struggles to maintain a semblance of peace in their tumultuous relationship. Allison's background as a member of the upper middle class makes her a target of Jimmy's ire, as he associates her with the societal structures he despises. Despite her suffering, Allison displays a quiet resilience and strength, making her a sympathetic character. Cliff Lewis, a working class friend who lives with Jimmy and Allison, acts as a buffer between the couple. He provides a stabilizing presence and tries to mediate conflicts often comforting Allison and diffusing Jimmy's anger. Cliff's easygoing nature and genuine affection for both Jimmy and Allison contrast sharply with Jimmy's volatility. His character highlights the theme of friendship and loyalty amidst the chaos of the Porter's marriage. The dynamic of the household changes with the arrival of Helena Charles, Allison's friend. Helena, a strong-willed and independent woman, disapproves of Jimmy's treatment of Allison and ultimately persuades Allison to leave him. Helena's presence intensifies the existing tensions, and she becomes a catalyst for significant changes in the characters' lives. Her intervention underscores the play's exploration of personal agency and moral choices. Allison's decision to leave Jimmy marks a turning point in the play. She returns to her family, seeking refuge from the emotional turmoil. Her departure forces Jimmy to confront his own vulnerabilities and the consequences of his actions. Allison's exit is a moment of both liberation and tragedy, as it highlights the deep emotional scars inflicted by their tumultuous relationship. In Allison's absence, Jimmy and Helena begin an affair. Their relationship is complex, characterized by a mix of passion and mutual antagonism. Helena's involvement with Jimmy brings out different facets of his character, revealing his capacity for tenderness and vulnerability. However, their relationship also serves as a reminder of Jimmy's destructive tendencies and the cyclical nature of his anger. The final act of the play sees Allison's return, now emotionally shattered by a miscarriage. Her return prompts a re-evaluation of her relationship with Jimmy. The reunion is poignant and fraught with unresolved emotions. Jimmy and Allison express their mutual pain and longing, leading to a tentative reconciliation. This moment underscores the enduring, albeit flawed, connection between them. Look Back in Anger concludes on an ambiguous note, with Jimmy and Allison's future uncertain. The play's exploration of personal and societal discontent, combined with its raw emotional intensity, left a lasting impact on British theatre. John Osborne's portrayal of the angry young man captured the zeitgeist of the 1950s, reflecting the frustrations of a generation.
The play remains a powerful commentary on class, relationships, and the search for identity in a changing world.